Whether you're a mother and you're taking your kids to go to the soccer field and you're stuck in traffic. If you're a doctor and you're trying to get to the emergency room on time and you're in a traffic jam, or if you're a student and your older car finally hits a pothole and the wheels come off, all of these are items that make quality of life you know, livable. And to have a system that is maintained is by far less expensive than one that is not. I think we've seen that the federal funding model has gotten the system to where it is now. But we're seeing also that without an increase in the gas tax in 23 years, the buying power of that whole system has diminished to over 50% loss in purchasing power. And so the federal funds are necessary, they're shrinking, and we need to bring that to the attention of our, our policymakers and see if we can suggest to them that a country that runs on an efficient transportation system is actually a very competitive system, a very competitive economy, and, and the money you put in it comes back many times.